hope you're all well from wherever you're watching me from these are our coffee you might be wondering why are they sun dried on the ground my grandma told me here they observe both heat from the ground and up so that's why they are put down unless if they are many you can get anything that is big and you put them on for easy carrier in case the trains let me just call people to help you out yeah i know and you're wondering what are we going to use our coffee keep watching so that you find out ah coffee now is so scarce guys Coffee beans used to be many. It used to be one of the common cash crop in Uganda. But apparently, food is becoming the cash crop. This is our motor and a peso. For this motor, you can grind or smash anything you want of your choice and also depends on your energy guys usually they grind medicine from here like the herbals, gilad, coffee, sinsin now look inside as you're saying it's dirty it was used before hope you're seeing that it was used before now i'm going to start by washing it since we are going to grind our coffee make coffee we have to make sure it's clean and it doesn't uh, smell for our coffee not to taste bad guys we use clean water by the way now the scent i'm getting is that of the herbs that we are grinding from here Okay, you don't only clean your motor but also your face as well because it's the one you're going to use to smudge whatever you put inside there. And now it's clean, you, you can take both under the sunshine to dry. We have to use it when it's dry. See us when it's dry. That I'm going to use to make my coffee. I told you they are scarce. Just this goes for one dollar. I want to show you the traditional way of making coffee. We are going to grind this, remove the husks of the coffee. First, remove those black covers. machines came and everything this is how it was done traditionally coffee has two layers guys if you didn't know So guys, I'm going to winnow this and remove the husks. Hope my coffee seeds are also not going. Because they are few, expensive, so I only want to remove the husks guys.
guys i realized i was looking losing my seeds so i decided to just select them okay guys as you can see i'm done setting fire Now I'm going to be restoring our seeds. <laughs> and of all the seeds, the coffee seeds we had, these are the ones we managed to get. I want to make a mango lens. Guys. So guys, we we'll look at them until they turn brown. Guys, I want to check on them. Some are lost in some are set. Some we are burning, but they have not yet changed. So I'm going to put them on heat for like a minute. Mm. Now, guys, the moment you remove. I'm trying to remove the husks before. Oh, the moment you remove them, just pour them inside. Just pour them in the mortar. And you start grinding right away when they are so hot. Why? It becomes easier to grind them. I think since they are small, that's why they were burning easily, but they take long to burn. This is the coffee we are trying to get. Hope you're seeing it. We might not be able to get a lot because the, the coffee seeds were small, but we are going to try. This is the reason as well. I have, I'm going to reheat it. There are some had seeds that maybe didn't burn well so I'm going to eat them again then I bring it again mm, I can smell coffee guys yes now they are turning oh,
hope you're seeing the difference. Hope you're seeing the difference, guys. This is the soft coffee, you see, and this is the coffee with the residues. You keep doing this, you give it time, and I'm smelling the coffee scent. We are boiling our tea, our water here. From here, we shall be making some coffee. Who doesn't want coffee? So my beautiful people, we are done. Yeah, hope you're seeing the difference. Close up. These are the coffee residues. Hope you're seeing them. And this is our original coffee. Yeah, hope you're seeing it, guys. You see, no residue, it's all smooth and soft. And hope you're seeing these ones so it's it can be of your choice if you want you can keep the residues but for me I have no use to it to get our perfect coffee this is all we needed so guys time to make coffee coffee lovers in the house where are you guys so guys this is where we're going to store our coffee Thank you for watching until this time. Comment down below where you're watching me from. So it depends on the quantity of coffee you do take, but this is enough for me. Thank you for watching guys. If you watched until this point, come and join me. We sip our coffee. Mm. This is the organic coffee. 